Good morning from Panhandle Outdoors, America's only daily outdoor TV show. Your source for fishing, hunting, and information for folks who enjoy the great outdoors. Now sit back, relax. It's Panhandle Outdoors. Uh oh, we got a rider. Greg. You look like a tourist. <laughs> I am. You don't like, you don't mind them yellow flies biting them legs? No, they don't. I'll make it in here. Greg Brodnicki. How you doing, sir? Good to see you, buddy. Bill, what are we doing today? Well, this I guess wind's we'll... supposed to let up. The later it gets, the less it's going to blow. I think we're going to go back in there where we were this morning and try well, to find some of those redfish in there. All right. And then when it does let up, I'm going to go over there and chase those redfish we should have been chasing this morning. But, uh, that's a, uh, that's kind of a nasty sky over there, huh? Ooh. With that sun being out, but I don't know. Well, folks, we got, we just started the motor, started drifting, and the first thing we run across, Greg, that rain over there, buddy. Yes, sir. Now, we better stay on the other side, we'll be okay. You can smell it. Take the gaff, Bill. Look at here. Look at here. Greg brings the first one in, about his third Man. cast. Uh. I'm glad I tight my drag up. He had an ambition. We're talking about an orange color. Greg, you got an orange? We're talking about that right here in the middle of the day. Now the sun's gone. Here comes that rain, guys. Yeah, Great. Not, look at it coming across there. Every fishing trip I've had this summer. It's going to go across there. Maybe I ought to put one of them Havocs on. Maybe I'll be able to throw it though, you know? Got him a little Havoc for a snag. Look at the color of that fish. Pretty good. How you release the trout. Good release. All right, Greg, what you got on, buddy? Oh, my. Wait a Look here. Oh, hold on. Oh yeah. I don't want to interfere with that cat. Ooh. 
I never would hear the end of that. Are you sure it's a catfish? Oh yeah, guaranteed. He's bumping like a catfish. He's bobbing and weaving like a catfish. It's a catfish. Yep. If it ain't a catfish. It is. It is a catfish. There it is. That's a nice one too. Oh yeah. Bill, you want to mount him? No, I don't think so. <laughs> we don't okay. get along that well. That's yeah. because it's good eating. Oh There's yeah. There's on my bag if you want. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Good Lord. A fight's a fight. Look at him. Well, we wanted to get some uh, video of fish. <laughs> Look at that. Good, right? Well, I'll tell you, excellent hook set. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he doesn't ever miss a cat. Oh boy. like a uh, good trout or maybe a redfish. Feeling good. I sure hope it's not a cat. <laughs> no, you've already caught, caught your cat today. I don't think it is. No, the way he came not up. Not the way he did. Must be foul yeah. hook. That has got to be the smallest head. net I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Why is that Why net so he little? To hold his head. Up. Hold his head up. But that, that's a panfish net. <laughs> that's a brim net. Brim net. Look at that. Yeah, but oh. it don't get son, hung look up. Look at that trout. That is a nice trout. He's there, buddy. fat, son. He's almost as big as the one That's I caught. That's a Bill Allen trout. Ooh. That is a Bill Allen trout. Good <laughs> Lord. Measure him. Good job, Greg. Yeah. I Even a blind that. squirrel can find an acre once in a while. That ain't bad for a mayor. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. He's got some shoulders on. Don't let him get them hooks in your paws. Hold yeah, him up there. Watch yeah. his gills. Oh, watch my gills. Yeah. Good what do you job. Think? Mayor. Not Mayor bad. Greg, brother Nicky. Not bad. Your dad would be proud of you, wouldn't he? Yeah, he would be. How big is it? Let's see. Let's measure. Well, he's probably see. about 20. I think it's 22. 22. Yep. 22. 22. Yeah, he'll probably go three, three and a half. What do you think? Three pounds? Good three pounds. Three yeah. And a half. Yes, All right. Well, we're going to. We're trout. We're going to put him back before he gets sick. He'll be five by tonight. Oh yeah. <laughs> right. Had some activity right here, Bill. Over here in the top water. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. Y'all gonna make me sweat the fire. All right, Greg, hook up again. Let's see if I can knock this thing off. What you think this time? Big, but he's he's. What do you think it is, Greg? It's a trout, but probably too grubby. Really. All right. Don't move them, I'm Oh, yeah. Fan fish, man. <laughs> I could have had enough for a nice meal tonight. Yeah. Thank you, Bill. You're welcome. Throwing off on my net. Yeah. Oh, 
have to go back in and get out and get this a little bit shallower. I know, water. I was just talking about that, but he did it. Sure did. And How far in were you coming in with it? He was about halfway in. Yeah. So, you know, pound and a half. Nice, uh, pretty. Mm, 16 and a half, 17. Got my good skitter wall. Oh no. That's always how it happened. Dad burn it. I got one. How did he what cut it? Oh, he got under the boat there. He made that jump. Alright, I got a camera on now. No pressure. <laughs> right on cue. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> well, he did it right on cue, though. I mean, we had a camera running when he hit. That's, that's good fishing right there. I right, just moved over on Greg's about third cast. He's hooked up again. Feels like he's foul. Yeah, he is. What you got, Greg? Trout. A little trout. Nice trout. Now, Greg Reed's in an orange color right there. Yeah, I got it on sale. <laughs> Greg is tearing it up. Oh, look at there. He got another one. Oh, yeah. Good trout. Man, are they dark. Yeah, you'd have a good mess today, Greg. He hit the front hook, did he? Mm -hmm. Nice. Pound and a half. Right. Get later on in the evening. The rain has gone away, but the wind sure has. Bill, what was the prediction today on the wind? <laughs> well, I looked at that fishing web, that fishing app thing that I've got. It was supposed to drop to five, a steady drop, and we were going to, of course, go over there and fish where we tried to fish this morning. But that's impossible. It's coming straight out of the south. It just never let up. It said about 15, I think. Easy. You got to hook him in the belly. Over there. One of them aquarium trout. <laughs> so you stopped the plug. I mean, you're reeling in, didn't I you was stop? reeling in. I went ahead and stopped it, and, and I guess he saw it tore into it. Really, Chris? Oh, man. I fell to wrapping it up. Bill, you just 
Greg, we had a good time, buddy. Yes, sir. That was fun. Captain Billy. <laughs> we, had, yes, sir. we had to do plan B and plan C because of the wind, but we wound up catching some fish. Hey, well, now it's not windy. Yeah, now it's, it's, it's getting dark. dark. Well, the sun's about to go down. Oh, man. And uh, we're going to get home at dark 30. You guys did good. It's only 20 minutes to 8. It's a little early. Now, for you, us. you about had a grand slam. Just about. If you'd got a little flounder. Maybe All I needed good. was a sailor's choice. <laughs> All right, we're going to head to the house. Moon's coming up, y'all. This is old school now. I've got one of those frog togs, but this is old poncho that I has been a standby. Yeah, I guarantee you I got my frog togs. <laughs> I guarantee you. We've been fishing maybe five or six casts. And here it comes. Ooh, here it comes. I love fishing in the rain. <laughs> Said no fishing whatever. All right. We got hooked up. There you go, Bill. Well. Wasn't exactly what we were looking for. He was a nice trout. If it was so inclined, but you know, we're trying to find a place out of the wind this morning, which is not that easy. But at the same time, a little trout right out of the mouth. He might make it for 14, he probably did. Happened, folks. We've gone to plan B. We've come across the bay. The weather dictated our plans this morning. We've come up in a little protected area still. You can see real stormy and it has rained on us hard. We've come across the bay up in this marsh area and we're going to try it here as long as we can. Actually, we've got blue sky right above us, but over here we've got black sky. All right, hooked up. What you got, Bill? Well, I think it's a redfish. If it's not, it's a big trout. It's acting like a redfish. He's acting like it. Or oh, sometimes yeah. you just get lucky with it. We had just talked about what it cost. Oh, hello. Good Lord. Is that a trout? I can't tell. I can't even. Yeah, that's a trout. So that's dark. a trout. Goodness, Weston. Wow. Here, you let me do it. I can't get it. Here, here, here. I, got, I got it, I got it. Okay, bring him over here. Okay. Holy smoke. Uh, all right, I got him here. That's a, Holy smoke. That's a nice trout there. <laughs> oh, yeah. No wonder I thought it was a redfish. Yeah, it acted like a redfish. It stayed down. He did. Probably a good idea not to lift him. Ow! <laughs> he got it pretty solid. Wow. Try not to do him any damage. Woo! That's, that's a beautiful trout. How that big is, is he, Bill? Huh? How big is he? Well, let's see. Weston, he's about 24 and a half. All right, 24 and a half inches. Pretty trout there, without, buddy. Uh, without pinching it, so yeah, yeah. goodness gracious. Sitting right off of that point over, that's where we caught those, found those redfish. That's there. right, uh-huh. Let me see if I can get that back in the water. He's probably fine. Yeah. I There you go. Yeah, he's okay. He, he's got plenty of energy. <laughs> Good job. Okay, folks, we got Winston hooked up here. What you got, Winston? You know, when he, he hit and jumped out of the water like a bass. He did. <laughs> he, he did. did. So it might be a bluefish or. I don't think so. He ain't running like a bluefish. He's like a little trout. Uh, well, may be a decent trout. Well, yes, you know, we decided we were here between the storm. There he is, right there. He's, I got a foul hook. That's why he's pulling so far. 
Well, that makes for a good fight. You need the net there, Winston? Uh, trout. Pretty trout. Another nice trout. <laughs> Another real nice trout. I think I'm just going to try to this is how an expert this sign expert does it careful now I have operated to take those out but it's not that much fun for either of us I think the coach got a grip on him that time I got some pliers in the pocket here if you need them or behind you. All right. If I can manage not to fall out of the boat. There you go, Winston. That's a good fish. Pretty That's a real good fish. Yeah, they jumping up out of the water too. He, they are actively hitting this top water and hitting around this point up here, which is where we found those redfish. Nice release there, Winston. All right. A switch. Show me what you got there. That's our true scholar. Yeah. Skidwalk. That's my favorite plug. Gotta love Skidwalk, guys. Yeah. All right. Good job, Winston. Look, we're gonna try to beat it in. We got another storm coming up. It's been a. Hey, Bill, we've had a good morning, buddy. It's been. A, we had fish probably over an hour and a half. Yeah, it's tough. Look at that storm. It's very tough. We're. Uh, you know, when we did have a break. I hate to leave, but I hate to be stupid too, because those fish are really feeding. They, they get that hard on yeah. top water and coming out of the water. Yeah, they still were feeding strong, but uh, this storm's coming in strong too. We're gonna we're gonna cut it off here. We'll get, get everything ready and we'll head back to the landing. Thanks for watching America's only Daily Outdoor TV show, Manhandle Outdoors with Winston Chester, featuring hunting, fishing, and other activities and information to help you enjoy the great outdoors. Join us next time for Panhandle Outdoors.